Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Pilot 2 k 7 back with another Granite Photo 5 Coastal Callouts video. Today we're going to be playing as the Port Authority Police and we're going to be policing all of the waterways here in Los Santos around the port. So this should be a pretty fun episode guys. We haven't did this in a really long time and if you guys are new to the Coastal Callouts series you have no idea what any of this is. It's a pretty awesome mod. It's still in beta by PNW Parks fan. But um, he is working on it and it pretty much lets us do a lot of boating and rescue and helicopter related call outs. So we're going to go ahead and get down here first. Now we also do have a new uh, texture on our Defender class boat as well. So we changed up the texture. This texture is by Yuki Case. So shout out to Yuki Case. Again, he posted this in the Coastal Callouts community discord. So very nice Los Angeles port. Uh, port police skin there so we're gonna go ahead and hop on as you can see we already have our crew here and if you guys would like early access to this boat or the mod in general coastal callouts you guys can get early access to it by checking out the links to the parks benefactor program which is in the video description down below so make sure you guys check out that and yes we made it onto the boat all right so we got our crew here we got one guy back here and I think we, yeah, we got another guy up front as well. And we have another um, Cole, I guess our first mate here. And we're going to be in charge of the boat. So let's go ahead and sit down in our seat. Get this thing on. Now it does have police lights. It does have sirens as well, which is pretty nice. So we can turn those off and turn them on as we need it. And we also have like this cool uh, light on the front as well as on the sides there as you can see so very versatile boat so let's go ahead and start our shift guys we're gonna let dispatch know we are 10 and available and let's see what we end up getting into today guys we haven't really we don't really have any plans for this so whatever happens is just gonna happen so we are gonna be looking for people doing like foolish stuff in here i want to go near the cargo ships too let's see if we can find the cargo ships make sure that nobody's trying to do anything stupid with the cargo ships and it'll be cool if like in GTA there was actually sh like sh ship traffic coming in and out of the port like cargo ships or cruise ships or stuff like that that would be pretty cool because then we could kind of like escort them in and out of the port like they do in real life um, I don't know if you guys ever been like on a cruise or anything like that but a lot of times when the cruises are leaving out of the port they get an escort by either the Coast Guard or the Sheriff Department or the Police Department, whoever polices the waterways in that area. So I've been on a couple cruises and not every single time we get the escort, but it's pretty cool when we do. Um, we got it a couple times from the Coast Guard um, and a couple of times from the Sheriff Department in Florida. I don't know what. Oh, crap. I don't know what um, department it was, but it's pretty cool. All right, so let's uh, let's see. I think we have to get around and in on this side over here. So we're gonna go out and then go to the left and then try to get over there. So let's see what we get into, guys. And again, we're just gonna be waiting to see what this batch gives us naturally. And I'm also trying to do some like that guy's is driving like an idiot. I'm also going to try to do some boat safety checks as well. Make sure people have their fire extinguishers, their flotation Citizens devices. Report a disturbance in Elysian Island. Units respond code 2. <laughs> there literally is something going on right here too. Um, we're not going to deal with that though. We'll let uh, security take care of that. This is David Charles 12. Copy. Cause that's not really a coastal call out call, so I don't want to waste time on that. All right, so this is where the cargo ships are. So let's probably head in here. You know, as long as I play GTA 5, I don't think I ever really went in this like Meriwether place over there. I know I went in there one time on a cuff server, but that's because we changed it up a little bit, but I don't think I ever like went in there. All right, so let's check out all of these big boats out here. So we got the sea urchin. What else we got? We got some smaller boats over there. Citizens report an assault on a civilian on Elysian Fields Freeway. Respond code 3. 
Ah, just another dead end here. There's another part. I think I gotta go around to the other side. Let me look at the map one more time. Let's go through here and see what this looks. This looks like the, that's a little Santos River there. Let's go around in here and see where that takes us and then we'll end up over here by the bigger cargo ships. Anyway, so let's just go exploring a little bit, guys. Let's see what we get into. But hopefully you guys are having an awesome day. As always, I thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys do enjoy this episode. Los Santos Gas Company, that's pretty cool. The thing with GTA 5 that I like, there's like so much detail in this game, like... And that's another reason why I like Coastal Callouts too, because it takes us to places where we normally wouldn't be. So we get to see a lot of cool things. This bridge over here is pretty low to the water level there. Alright, so we're gonna turn... Whoa, what are you doing, buddy? Slow it down and he's gonna hit the wall. Yep, okay, so that's gonna be our first traffic stop. And then we also got these jet skiers acting reckless in here as well. So, that guy just crashed. Let's make sure he's not under the influence or anything. So we're gonna go ahead and actually do a traffic stop on him. This guy's just literally trying to go in. Where are you going, sir? Alright, so we signal for him to stop here. So we're probably gonna board his ship as well. Alright, so another cool feature of Coastal Callouts, we can actually anchor our boat, so our, we don't have to worry about our boat floating away or anything like that. As well as the suspect's boat as well. So once we get out, as you can see, your boat and the suspect boat will automatically be anchored. So that's awesome. All right, so let's go talk to this person and let's see what their deal is. Hello, sir. My name is Ace with the uh, Port Police. What are you What are you doing in here? Do you know how to Do you know how to operate this boat? Yeah, I saw you guys crashed into the wall here. It looks like you didn't have control of this thing. Um, let's see if we can actually talk to him a little bit. All right. Um, I should have probably asked him that first. So do you have a boating license, sir? Let's go ahead and start with that. Yeah, we're we're going to check and see if he actually does have a valid boating license. So his name is Dylan Justice. Okay. Uh, his license is suspended. It looks like his license was suspended possibly for drinking and driving. Let's see if we get some more information about that here in a second. Once I get myself out of that animation. Alright, hold on one second there, Dylan. Let me just check something. Alright, so I think he's going to get arrested here. Just want to check something on our... Uh, computer here all right so his license is suspended here so that means he shouldn't be operating his vehicle whether it's a drive of car or boat or anything he's not supposed to be operating anything right now okay so we're gonna go ahead and most likely arrest him for that let's go ahead and talk to him a little bit more now i do see he does have his um he does have his proper um, uh, life vest on, so that's good. So um, I just have a couple more questions. I can see you guys all have your life jackets on. Do you have a fire extinguisher on board? Safety first. Okay, he just showed it to me. Let me get on board his boat so you guys can see. All right, let's do this again. All right. So can you just, <laughs> I just got my leg up on here. Can you just go ahead and show me that one more time, please? Okay, so he does have the fire extinguisher, as you guys can see. All right, perfect. Do you have any flares or distress signals in case you have any problems? No, you don't. Well, you actually do need that, sir. Like, say if you were stuck and this thing started sinking, how are we going to know how to find you if you don't have no radios, no flares? So. 
you're gonna definitely want to make sure you get that okay that is mandatory now I do have a couple more questions about you are you aware that your license is suspended no sir your license is not valid at all I'm actually asking you to go ahead and uh, stand up for me okay okay all right so I do have a couple more questions are you under the influence of any alcohol or anything like that sir I'm just gonna try to do a breathalyzer on him. All, all right so I'm just gonna go ahead and breathalyze just to make sure you're not drunk okay like I said the way that you were driving it looks like either you don't know what you're doing or it looks like you're under the influence of something Okay, sir, so it looks like you actually have been drinking. Um, you're not over the legal limit, but you... Oh, no, 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 Well, at least he didn't fall. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna just place him in cuffs. Alright. Alright, so you are being placed on arrest for operating your boat without a proper license, okay? Your license is suspended. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Do you have anything illegal on you or on the boat I need to know about, sir? Okay, let's go ahead and search him down really quickly. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> oh, underwater search. All right, nothing. Now. Let me get back up before I die. You guys already know, man. It's not a close call out episode until I end up in the water. So it's official. It is officially a Coast Scar or Coast Callouts episode. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and put this guy in our boat. And he's inside. Alright, um, sir, do you have a boating license by any chance? No? Okay. Um, you don't have anything illegal on you, right? Can I get him up? Trying to get him out of here first. Here we go. Police! Stop whatever the hell you're doing! Oh, no, 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 no. <sighs> sir, get back over here. You're gonna drown over here, sir. Well, you do have a life vest on, but. Alright, we're just gonna pull him in. I don't know what his problem is. I should probably try this with Stop the Pet and see how it works. Maybe it'll be easy to keep them from running away. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and bring him back in. And I'm gonna pat him down. And um we're gonna also have to search this boat as well, and then we'll get these guys out of here. Alright, so he could go actually let's pat him down first. Oh that's not what I wanted to do. No, 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 don't throw him in the water again. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, we need to use the bigger boat, guys, so we have more room to work with. I'm searching him in the water, I think. <laughs> yep, I'm searching him in the water. Okay, he's good. Alright, you go ahead and take a seat in the boat, okay? Okay, so they're both in fat. I'm gonna search this boat as well. I'm just gonna keep falling in the water, I guess. Dispatch to all Coast Guard units. We've got a medical emergency on a boat off the East Coast. Units requesting helicopter support. Ah, uh, too bad we're not in a helicopter. That's a good call right there. Alright, let's go ahead and search this bad boy down. And I guess we'll tow it ourselves. Alright, nothing, nothing. Alright, perfect. So, yeah, we'll tow this thing. Let's go ahead and get back in here. So, um, I didn't even get the other guy's name. Just gotta run him as well. So, other guy name, it didn't tell me. We only have Dylan's name. I would like to search him, make sure he doesn't have any warrants or anything like that. Alright, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and try to tow this thing now. So we're gonna open up our coast callouts menu, we're gonna go down to towing, and I'll do it ourselves. We could call another boat, but we'll do it ourselves. Now I just saw something interesting. Let's see if I could catch it in time. Uh where did it go?
Oh, cool. Never noticed that down here in the port before. All right, cool. Sometimes my F9 doesn't work, so I gotta do it that way. All right, so, did I tow it already? I don't think I did. So let's go ahead and get ready to tow this thing. I think I may have to get around to the front of it. Oh my God, this guy. What is wrong with everybody, man? Let me grab the preserver. Oh, is he able to get on? Okay, you can't just leave your jet ski there, sir. Sir, it's gonna get towed if you leave it there. Hey, yeah, yeah. I don't know what's going on with all these people. All right, let's. Now we're gonna definitely need a tow. We need somebody to come get that jet ski. So let's get somebody to get that jet ski first, and then we'll uh, probably tow the boat ourselves. All right, so we have a boat on the way to come pick that up for us, and then we're gonna try to take this one. All right, so this one we're gonna tow ourselves. All right, we got it. All right, so we got this one. Somebody's coming for the jet ski. I'm trying to see where they're at so you guys can see it. I set them on the map, but it looks like they disappeared. But anyway, let's go ahead and drop these guys off, probably back at our station. So we're gonna come out here. Damn, we didn't even get to go where I wanted to go. So we're gonna come back out here and go to our station and drop these guys off. So a little bit of first person here. I love how this guy's just like chilling out here in the front. <laughs> That's so cool. This guy got his knee all up in my back. Alright, so we're gonna make this turn around the airport. Do any of you guys like boating in real life? Like any of you guys like going out on the ocean or a lake or a river? In any type of boats or anything like that? I kind of like it. It's fun. I've been to a couple of places in New Jersey. We did like uh, tubing and stuff like that. And this is basically like tubing too, basically. Like how we're towing the boat. But we did like tubing, which was a ton of fun one year. And then we did... um. We didn't do kayaking. We were supposed to do it one time, but then we also did... What's that other thing? Um, the one where you gotta use like a snowboard kind of thing, wakeboarding. I think that's what it's called. We did that before. That was fun. Alright, so we're gonna have to dock his boat up over here. Oh, the fire boat is here now, guys. It wasn't here earlier. They must have just came back from a call. All right, um, we're gonna have to put this somewhere. Citizens report a prohibited radio broadcast in uh, Elysian Island. Units respond code two. Now we're pulling in a little bit closer over here. Ocean one, we can get that. If you guys didn't see the fireboat in the last two videos we did or the last couple of videos definitely go ahead and check it out all right so we're gonna drop this guy off here and we're gonna also stop towing that or stop pulling it in all right perfect so let's get this guy transferred off he's good oh we gotta let go of that boat
And then let's also get rid of this other guy as well. He's free to go. We didn't get to check his name, but it's okay. <laughs> of course he ends up in the water. Can I just grab him and throw him in? Oh. Alright, RIP. He lost his collision, so... Hopefully he made it okay. Alright, so we're gonna leave this other boat here. We'll, uh, get it... Um... We'll get it, um... Attached here. We're gonna go ahead and get back out on patrol. Attention all Coast Guard units. We have suspicious offshore activity on a boat off the south coast. Alright, we're getting a call for dispatch, guys, so let's go ahead and take this one. It wants us to look for a boat that's right behind us. Are you kidding me? We're never going to get out of this area. Alright, so it wants us to do a traffic stop and a boat and safety inspection on a boat out here. So let's go look for it. I think he's underneath. Yeah, he's under there. How did you even get in there, sir? Alright, we're gonna have to try to get him out. Let's see. Damn, his boat got screwed up. Yeah, let's just throw him over there. Take him out now. I just did that just in case he lost his collisions again like that last guy did. How about fast this boat is? Alright, uh, it looks like they're gonna be over here. Let's go ahead and perform a traffic stop on them. We haven't had a boat pursuit in a while. Pull it over, guys. Pull it over. Alright, so we got them stopped. Let's go ahead and to board his vessel here so we're gonna be doing a boat and safety inspection this time and his boat really does not look safe he also doesn't have a life vest on either so by the way his boat looks it doesn't even look like he even has a life vest on his boat hello sir Los Los oh, Los Angeles Port Police prepare to pre prepare to have your boat uh, boarded okay sir okay Let's get ready to board. Hey guys, um, keep an eye on this guy. He looks a little sketchy, right? Alright. So let's get ready to board. Alright, sir. Um, like I said, my name is Ace with the, uh, Los Angeles Port Police. You have any idea why I'm stopping you today, sir? Well, clearly it wasn't for speeding since you caught me. Well, yeah, you were speeding, but um, I do notice your boat looks a little bit banged up there, and I don't want you to get into any accidents or anything like that, or start sinking or anything like that. Do you have the um, proper life jackets in the event that this ship starts to uh, uh, sink? We're all good swimmers, why would we need life jackets? Well, you could be the best swimmer in the world, sir, but you could still drown, especially out here in the ocean. If this thing uh, breaks down or you get hurt and you may not be able to swim at 100%, you could end up drowning out here, sir. Uh, do you have fire extinguishers on board? Okay, so at least he has his fire extinguisher, that's good. you have any distress signals like flares? Don't need anything like that? Okay. All right, that's that's interesting. Um, you have your license registration and um, insurance for this thing. Get up. Lorenzo Ellison. All right, Lorenzo, sit tight for one second. Just gonna run some information. I'll be right back. Okay. All right, so let's get back on our boat and let's run his information and let's see what we get here. Really gotta change that. Uh oh, this guy is wanted, guys. All right, so he's gonna end up going to jail. Wanted for violent crimes, battery, and serious bodily injury. Lorenzo Ellison. Let's go ahead and call that into dispatch as well, just to confirm. All right, so we're gonna call that in. 
If you guys are still watching up to this point, I also want to say thank you. And like I said, make sure you guys hit that like button as well. And yep, that is a positive 99 coming out of Los Santos Police. Alright, so he's going to be uh, coming in with us. Hey, Lo hey Lorenzo. Alright, do me a favor. Go ahead and stand up for one second. Alright, Lorenzo, go ahead and place your hands behind your back, okay? LSPD! Don't make me shoot ya! Go ahead and place your hands behind your back. Oh, my peds are tweaking out over there. <laughs> uh oh, we're gonna have to fix that. Stop! Police! Alright, so, oh, I forgot that was gonna happen. Damn, I'm just spinning like this whole episode on the water. Alright, note to self, next time you do it the other way. Wait, what? I just saw a body right there. Ah, crap. I think something glitched out big time. If they like... How... Oh my god, now he's summoning. Alright. Something's going bad. I think when I um went to arrest him, it like made another version of him or something. So let's go ahead and place him into my boat and then let's go get the other version of him. So he's inside. Yeah, let's go grab the other one now. Hey, where did this guy come from? Alright, let's grab this one. Come on. Wait, how many are there? I think it's the reflections. Okay, we got him. Uh, this one's gonna have to go to the hospital. Right. His name changed to Deshaun. Okay, so we're gonna have to get Deshaun to the hospital, guys. Oh, do we have enough seats? Why do you keep getting out? <laughs> oh my god. He went in and just, like, fell out. Alright, you just get in there too, okay? I have no idea what's going on. Right. Any available like Coast Guard unit, it. we've got an SOS call okay, off the is, south this coast. Is all all units right respond. So let's just get rid of all of these people. <laughs> let's get a transport out here for him and then I'm gonna look and see if I can for find a suspect placed under the, uh, arrest second in version of him and see if we can take him to the, to the ambulance or something. On the so. way! I'm going to prison a transport out here to take him away. Looks like they're going to be pulling up right here, and then we're going to see if the other guy body is still floating around here. Alright guys, so prison of transport is here. It looks like my guys aren't tweaking out anymore. Um, I'm going to see... I don't see that guy anymore. Not sure what ended up happening there, but yeah, let's just go ahead and get out of here. Something glitched out. It must have been some type of con uh, conflict there. So let's search this thing and then let's get somebody else to tow this one. Okay, nothing adventure. So yeah, let's get somebody else to tow this one here. Alright, so we have a boat on the way to come pick this one up. Uh, let's get back on to ours. Yeah, I wonder what happened. I really wanted to, um... I really wanted to, um... Take that other guy to the hospital. Alright, so here's our tow boat. We actually got the sheriff department out here. So as you can see, we have multiple agencies and multiple jurisdictions out here working together. To keep everybody safe. Let's see if we get a closer look at that. Yeah, he just, his turn in radius was extreme right there. Sheriff and port police. Oh, I cannot turn as tight as them. This looks pretty awesome. I love how they're hanging on the side and stuff like that on their ships. I 
I believe um, the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department also operates a Marine unit as well. I'm not sure how the jurisdictions and everything goes, but pretty cool. Alright, let's go ahead and break off, guys. And I'm not sure if we're going to do anything else, but I, do, I did want to go to the cargo ship. So let's just head over there and see how that stuff looks. Let's see. We're going to have to go all the way around. So yeah, let's head to the cargo ships, and then we'll probably end the episode over there. Again, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Make sure you guys hit that like button if you guys did enjoy the episode. And also leave some comments. I love leaving the comments, reading the comments that you guys leave. But um, thank you guys so, so much. Again, 2018 was awesome. And I'm excited to see what 2019 has in store for us, guys. Very, am very excited. Also, if you guys have any other suggestions or ideas that we should do, any specific department you guys want to see in the next episode, definitely let me know. Again, by leaving a comment down below. Um, like I said, we could do Coast Guard, we could do boats, we could do helicopters, we could do, as you see, port police, we have the sheriff that you guys just saw, we have the small boats, we have the big boats. There's so much we could do with Coastal Fallouts, guys. So definitely let me know what else you guys would like to see i didn't mean to come around this way but i guess it's okay yo we're getting some major air right now too oh Woo. that would have been bad that would have been bad you better put your seatbelt on up there buddy we nearly got hit look at these cargo ships some of these cargo ships, we could actually drive too. Like, would you guys like us to like try to drive a cargo ship? I don't know how much fun that would be because these things are like big and slow, but they're pretty cool. They are pretty cool. Maybe I'll try to do a video with us like escorting one. Like, I'll try to use menu and see if I can get it to um like drive out of the port and then we'll escort it out of the port. That would be pretty cool. But I think we're going to go ahead and end the video here, guys. So hopefully you guys did enjoy. Again, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Oh, this is where I was trying to originally come. I was trying to come through here. But thank you guys so, so much for watching. Make sure you guys hit that like button if you guys did enjoy. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.